Hi guys, so we've uh, woken up for sunrise today, like usual, and we're here at Pyramid Lake. Um, basically, it's a little island that has this uh, cool little wooden bridge going out to it, and then the mountains that are currently lit up in the background. So I think it's time to take some photos before the light goes away, because it's really nice on the mountains right now. So I'll show you those now, and I'll talk to you in a bit. Hi guys, so uh, we're back at camp right now. After this morning's sunrise shoot, we came back and took a nap because we were exhausted. And um, then we walked around the town of Jasper, got a few stickers. Nolan got a new uh, camera battery for his film camera, so that was a successful uh, mission accomplished. And uh, now we're packing our gear back up and we're going to Medicine Lake, I think the name of it is. I don't really remember what it looks like, but apparently it's mountains and a lake which is what we've been shooting for about three days now. So, typical thing here in uh, Canada. Uh, but yeah, it's almost sunset. I think sunset's about two hours from now, two and a half hours from now, but I think it's a 45 minute drive. So, we gotta leave and take some sunset photos and I'll talk to you guys there. Okay, so we made it to Medicine Lake. We uh, saw a bear on the way, didn't get any shots of that bear. But now we are walking a little trail, trying to find the, the best lookout for the lake and the mountains that are gonna about, about to get lit up by the uh, sunlight. So, time to walk, and I'll show you guys the photos. Alright guys, it's Nolan here. We uh, just took shots from about this angle. Mitch had his nice orange jacket on. Now, he has to try to get back. And it was a struggle for him to get out there. <laughs> Toes are bleeding. He, uh, <laughs> so he opted to take his shoes and just soak them so he didn't cut up his feet worse. So I'm gonna film this little voyage back to shore. Oh god. It's already slippery. Ah! How's the water temperature out there? What? How's the water temperature out there? Pretty freaking cold. Look at that view though. But clearly I'm dedicated if I'm uh. doing this. Lol. A lot of mosquitoes out here today. Oh yeah. Just have small talk with my audience while I freeze to death. Look at him. Freezing. Ah. Slicing up his feet real good. You're like almost there. No I'm not. Basically there. It's actually a lot warmer with the shoes on. Think so? You're doing great. I'm doing terrible. Almost there. How did it get here? 
<laughs> oh, fuck. Are you enjoying your swim today? Yep. Over there? Oh yeah. It looks like it. Oh Lord, save me. I'm so cold. But that view, was it worth the shot? Whew, okay, um, so clearly I'm a dedicated photographer because as you just saw from Nolan's beautiful video uh, b-roll work that I uh, swam out there, not really swam, I crawled half wet out to these rocks and uh, posed out there for our photo and I'm very cold. Uh, it's time to go back to the car, get me dry, and uh, apparently no one has something to say, so here you go. If you want me to make a YouTube channel also, comment on Mitchell's. I probably won't do it, but if you guys get like 300 comments or something, then I'll do it. 300 comments? What about how many likes? Uh, I don't care. You don't care? No. Two likes and then you'll do it? Yeah, at least two likes. At least at least two likes on this video and then he, he might make a YouTube channel. I'll put a poll in this video too and see if you guys want Nolan to make a YouTube channel. Uh, okay, so back to the car and I'll put clothes on, don't worry. Hey guys, so I probably know what you're thinking. You're not in the car. You said you are going to the car. Well, uh, I, I realized that I didn't end this video when I was editing it. I'm um, towards the end of the video and I never signed off. So here we are in the future, I guess. Basically, after that little dip in Medicine Lake, me and Nolan went back to the car, as I said. We went back to camp and we went right to bed. We had, that was the, the, like, the pinnacle, the end of our, um, the major part of the road trip. So we were exhausted as I sure I said in almost every single video. Um, so we went back to the campground, went to bed that night, and that was our last day in Jasper. The next few days we had left Jasper in the morning. Uh, we made a quick stop to Emerald Lake, which is in Yoho National Park on our way south back towards Montana. After that we got to the USA-Canada border around midnight, which was kind of annoying because the, the border that we went to was actually closed. So we had to, we had to take a two hour detour at midnight um, from one border to another border crossing, which was 24 hours, it was open 24 hours. So we crossed the border around 2 a.m., got to a, a northern Montana campground about 3 a.m., we went to bed, and then the next day after that we went down to Yellowstone. Uh, while in Yellowstone, I had gotten kind of burnt out with the whole vlogging thing, considering that I did it from all the way through Scotland, Norway, and then right into the road trip. So I was a little tired of it. I took a few days break. I did try to film a little bit, and I tried to make a video in Yellowstone, but uh, there just wasn't, I just didn't take enough clips. We did a, a short little hike to um, Osprey Falls. And besides that, we didn't do much else in Yellowstone. We went to Grand Prismatic Spring, which is one of my favorite overlooks in the park. It was just during the day, so the lighting wasn't very good. We didn't get very many good photos, but we did see a fox on that Grand Prismatic Spring hike, and I got two of my favorite fox photos ever, which I'll throw up right now. The reason that we didn't stay in Yellowstone for very long is because I had done Yellowstone the year before this on another road trip and I know that in the summer Yellowstone is just a hassle. There's so many tourists. It's overflowing with tourists and I knew that and I, I told Nolan that he wanted to go so we did a, a, a quick stop through and we saw a few of the major sites. But besides that we didn't spend much time in Yellowstone. We went down from there to the Tetons. We spent two nights, I believe, in the Tetons. One night we spent sleeping in our car because we didn't have a campground. 
and then the other night we spent in a campground and we took a few photos in the Tetons. I'll throw some more photos of the Tetons right now. Besides that, I didn't really take much video. So the next video that you're gonna see is gonna be about four days from this Jasper video. Uh, we're gonna skip forward to Nebraska, Kearney, Nebraska with my friend Philip Thomas. I had met him on the uh, previously mentioned road trip that I did last year. And uh, we just got be good friends. He just recently put out a video of uh, me and Nolan visiting. And so if you haven't seen that, I'll link it in the description or up here in one of the corners. His channel is going to be down in the description as well. So he's a good friend of mine. He has a YouTube channel. I'm trying to give him some of my subscribers and he's shouting out to me. So let's try to build up our communities and just get this whole YouTube thing going because I'm excited. That's going to be next week's video. Sorry about the lack of uploads in the past few weeks. There's been a few family issues at home but we're gonna get back to that one video a week schedule. So after the Nebraska video, I will be done with the road trip. And uh, if you saw my life channel and um, work update a few months ago, you will remember that I mentioned I was going on another trip and that trip was actually to Argentina. So to visit my friend Carlos for two weeks. The next videos you're gonna see are from Argentina. And then after that, it's gonna be, um, I don't have any more left, so I'm going to have to go out and make videos, which is actually fun, and I'm really excited to do that because I did get myself a Christmas present about a month and a half ago, and it is actually the Ronin S. So I'm really excited to use this, um, so the videos are going to be much better from here on out. Yeah, I'm just excited to keep this going, so I guess I'll see you guys in the next video from Nebraska, where we see Philip. So, I'll see you then. Peace out.